All right, here we are, guys. We are out today doing some retail trash, and I can tell you it has been a while since we've done this. It's been a hot, humid summer. Gas prices have been high. I don't like just driving around randomly hoping to find trash when I'm spending $50 to put some gas in the car. So um, I've been stopped for a while while it's been super hot. So we're going to get back out there, though, and see what we can find in the trash that we can save, reuse, resell, or donate. Um, hopefully, we find some good stuff today. So we'll pull around here. I'm excited because it's been a while. Um, and it is September, so it's not cold yet, but it's starting to cool down in the mornings and afternoons. So I'll take that. So let's check this PetSmart real quick here. See if there's anything in here we can find today. Somebody's dumped a pair of blinds. That's not really PetSmart trash. Nothing really in there. I can't use cut open bags of food, so I will pass on that one. Although I do would like to find some food because I have a friend of mine who um, is living on assisted income and has a husky and he needs food. So if I could find some food today to give to him, that would really be nice. Check this Dollar Tree. All kinds of cardboard here. Wow. This is a mess. I'm not going to find much in here. A lot of cardboard. See what's in Michael's. See some bubble wrap. Check it. Definitely use bubble wrap. Got some Halloween. Looks like some Halloween stuff there. Looks like they got rid of the displays. Matting displays, look. And they're gone. Yeah, it's all displays today. I'll take this bubble wrap though. That's a little dirty. Let me take that. Definitely take that. I think that's about it. We're gonna find much else in here. Okay. <clears throat> Maintenance is behind me, but they're not they're not bothering me. They never do. Alright. We're gonna nip across the street to check Walmart and Party City and then we'll head out to the next park. Um, got some bubble wrap. I'm pretty happy with that. Looks like Target has a skip dumpster. Am I going to check it? Absolutely. Never pass a skip dumpster. It's a real small one. Looks like concrete though. Maybe they're doing some remodeling. Definitely nothing in it. 
Usually if they're low like that, it's remodeling debris or something. All right. Always check them though. Because you never know if someone's going to dump something in there. You know, if people throw stuff in the trash that they're not supposed to be throwing in the trash. Yeah, I see the remodeling again. Then you might find something not Target or not the other company because people throw things away all the time in the skip dumpsters. Shouldn't be throwing things away, but if you can find something good in them, why not? But always check them. Let's go across the street, see what we can find. Alrighty, let's see what we find back here. I feel like it's been forever since I've done this. All right, big lots. Let's see if there's anything in your trash. Oh, shame. Nothing in big lots. I was hoping I'd find some stuff today in big lots. It's empty. Well, hopefully we don't have a bunch of empty trash cans today. Because these three are empty. Big Lots is one of my favorite dumpsters, so I was hoping we'd find some stuff in there, but apparently not. Try Bed Bath & Beyond here. Looks like there's some stuff in there. See what we can find back here that they haven't spray painted. These are good for canned goods. Take those. Okay, it's broken. It's broken. Broken plant they sprayed. They break everything. Problem with them. Break and spray paint everything. Maybe these are broken. Oh well, I'm on pass. I find, find plenty of stuff that's not broken, so I'm not going to take broken stuff. I don't really, really need those things, so what's the point taking them if they're broke? Alright, well, I know Ulta is empty. Let's see if Kirkland's has anything here. Empty! Okay, well, what's going on over here? I don't think I can get by. That's kind of, uh, I don't know why they're blocking traffic. if I can get by on this side or not, and why they didn't pull over. I think I might be able to get by. Oh yeah. I can get by. Remodeling Joanne. Looks like this area might be already empty for the day. in there. Okay. Nothing in there. Okay. 
Check this Walmart area down here, and then we're off to another area. Not much going on in this area today, so. It's the way it works, though. Some spots are empty, and the next spot may be full. It's just dumpster diving is the luck of the draw. Don't even know if Walmart will have any dumpsters. It's been such a while since I've been retail trash. I've been doing a lot of bolt trash, and even the bolt trash has been really, really hard to find good stuff because it's just so hot. People are not they're not out cleaning their garages and doing all that stuff. As soon as it starts cooling down, it's going to get real good. I think most stores are already gearing up for fall big time, so I mean, we've already got cargo containers, be stocking for Christmas and all kinds of stuff pretty soon. A bunch of Walmart people out. Trash can, I don't see much in it, and I don't want to stop and get yelled at, so we're going to head to the next spot. Alrighty, let's check this. Pet smart here. I can't tell if it's been emptied or not. I've been gearing up for all this. And we might be... Thursdays might be not good days anymore. I don't know. Doesn't look like anything in there, does it? over there real quick. Make sure there's nothing in here. Nope. Okay. Well, there's trash in there, just nothing to take. Although this area is not got a lot of dumpsters to pick from. There's a couple that we look at. Definitely gearing up. They got all the holiday. Storage things here already. Halloween and Christmas. All everything ready to go. Thanksgiving. It looks pretty uh, full of bags. Let's see if there's anything in here. Could be. Take some of these bags out so we can actually look in there. Put them back when we're done. Broken. Okay. 
just a bunch of bags. It's full, but nothing in there. Whoop, making a mess. All that back in there. Okay, well, nothing here either. Okay. All right, let's head over to the other side. See if we can find anything there. Hopefully we find something today, guys. All righty, let's see what we can find over here. <clears throat> Only one star we look at over here. The rest are all, like, there's a shoe store that doesn't ever throw anything away, and there's a, some food places, which I don't bother looking at, of course. But, um... We always check Michael's. And they're building something up here. I don't know what they're putting in, but they're building in something here. Five below. Of course they are. Heck yeah. I'll be able to see in Five Below's dumpster and Michael's the same dumpsters. That'll be solid. If they don't rip everything up. Ooh, what we got going on in Michael's? Cow, look at all that Halloween stuff. I'll take all this. Looks like a bunch of Halloween goodies. One thing about this car I don't like. When you put it in park, it locks all the other doors. Alright. all kinds of stuff in here guys look at all that okay I'm gonna get in still use that. Broken. 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 Bird cage. Probably gonna be a lot of broken stuff in here, but like that's not broken. Just needs re-glued. Let's take this to the truck so if they come out, I don't get told to go away and forget it all. Sometimes if it's a little bit broken, it can be fixed. And what have we got on this side? Nothing wrong with that. 
What's that say? Pumpkin patch? Heck yeah. back there real quick. Full of Halloween stuff. All right. Well, that was worthwhile. Some of it may be broken. We might have to do a little repair, but it's Halloween. I don't mind fixing a little bit of stuff. I'll check these, and even though I really know these are nothing. like a pool company or something but webs or something yeah yeah ain't nothing in here all right we're gonna head off to the next spot we'll see you guys there what a good haul from Michaels hopefully we'll find some good stuff in those boxes that aren't too broken I'm sure we'll find some stuff we can reuse. All right, heading out. All righty, guys, we're on the other side. Let's check out Joanne and see what we can find. Hard to tell if it's empty or not. Hopefully they're not empty, because that would be, the rest of them all might be empty. No, not empty. This bubble wrap, definitely taking this. Get all my packing for free. Why pay for packing supplies when the stores throw it away? Bunch of magazines ripped up. Let me know. Cycling area, not much in here at all. Okay. Not too much. We'll go check the other side there and <clears throat> see what's in their trash cans. Alright. Let's go see what we can find around here. Alright, let's check home goods here guys, see what we can get. That's empty. That's a bummer. Home goods is emptied. See, I don't know whether to do Wednesdays or Thursdays. I come both days and sometimes I get trash and sometimes I don't. It's really weird and it's early, so. You never know what to expect. And I could come Wednesday and the same thing, it's empty, so. 
it's the time of year maybe I don't know it's hard to say all right let's check this uh, big lots it looks like the things off that so might be emptied already Nothing, nothing in here. Usually if this is... Yep, it's empty. Hmm. I can see all the way down there that Burlington's full. So it just gotta be certain dumpsters certain days, which is annoying because I can't come every day. You'd think they would empty the entire mall at the same time not do certain dumpsters because then that just means well that means certain dumpsters are full and certain dumpsters are empty which is silly to me but hey I'm not the garbage people I don't know here's Michael's Let's check it real quick looks like there's a skip dumpster over there I don't know what that store is I know there's a big food shopping store here Oh, Michael's has stuff in it. Bunch of garbage, nothing really worth taking. Okay. Keep heading on, heading on. dumped a couch next to a grocery store dumpster. Yeah, I don't know what store this is. Marshalls and Party City? Let's check that. Bet it's remodeling. I can see some drywall and shelving up there. It's probably getting rid of old store fixtures or something. like literally just garbage. I don't see anything in there I would take. Bags of trash. So <laughs> hoping to be old merchandise. There you go. Check Party City. boxes today because they don't recycle just so you know party city throws their garbage in the same trash can as they're recycling all right there's Burlington it looks like it's full of bags we'll go check them out going on over here. This dumpster used to give me all kinds of stuff. Down here. Saw socks. Broken dishes. Those look like they have juice in them, which is gross. Mirrors, those are all broken. Not even one of them can be salvaged. Anyway. Maybe not everything's made out of plastic now. Everything. What do we got here? Oh, nothing. Broken. Oh, look at that. Dane Craft. Genuine pearl. Missing some earrings. Okay. Forgot the cars locked. Get out here. Broken dish. 
dishes. Tiny Nike box, that's cute. Cute necklace, one earring, but the necklace is good. Nothing wrong with that. Right over here. Okay. All right, off to the next. Looks gonna be deceiving. Look like we might find some stuff, but we got one little bit of jewelry. Why not? Hey. Make sure I'm still recording here. Yeah, okay. Alright, so we got five below coming up here, guys. It's getting a little hot. That's why I did this super early. Get this done and go check Kirkland too. But let's check five below. stuff in there, whether or not they smashed it or not, needs to be seen. Let me check. That's probably an old cartridge. Yep. everything in five below anymore. Yeah, okay. Smash everything to bits. I think it matters anyway. Some tool. We're missing anything at five below. It's a bunch of cheap crap. Alright. Some tool. That's some missing pieces. Shut this lid up. Nice big roll of red tool. Let's go see if there's anything over here real quick. Then we'll hit PetSmart and we're off to the next spot. Okay. It's already getting warm.
baskets come undone. Slashed up for me. No surprise. Okay, nothing. All right, thought we'd check. Sometimes I find some stuff in there that they haven't broken. Okay. I don't like to drive all the way up there because it's too close to the doors. Okay. All right, so we got PetSmart up here. found any food today. I was hoping I'd hit a big lot to get some cereal and stuff like that. That dumpster's gone now, which is really weird. Why would they get rid of the dumpster? Unless this is now the dumpster because it's closer to the door. Let's find out. Let's find out, shall we? It's, they don't have a trash compactor, so... Yep, this is their dumpster now, obviously. Let's see what's in there. shoes take them when you find them. beds. I don't know why they cut them. Oh, I know why they cut them. Because they're jerks. Could have donated these to the bottom of that. Those are cute, but they should have a hard bottom, shouldn't they? Maybe rip those up. Ooh, the cat can still use them. Nice dog toy. Cat train, oh thanks. Okay. These are cute. Even if I donate them. Can always donate them. Somebody will still use them, I can tell you that. Even if they don't have the hard thing in the bottom, cats will still get in them. Guarantee you. And now I have food for Roy's dog. She'd be 
pretty happy with that. He's got a big Siberian Husky, so that might get him a couple weeks or a month. And then I don't know what this thing is. Canister filter. Okay. Zoom in. Turtle clean. Okay, I don't know if these other things go with it or not, but... Shut this up and do our diligence to at least keep it clean, right? This is probably recyclables. Yep. Alright. Got some pit stuff. Okay, well, we're getting some stuff today. Let's head on to the next spot. I'll see you guys there. Check this Petsmart real quick and then quickly check that Burlington. They do have security here, so we have to do it pretty quick in this area. Definitely nothing there. Pretty much like the only area that ever bothers me with security anymore though. No place else ever really bothers me. There's only one security cart and if she's already done her rounds and she's not going to be here. Just check it quickly. This is Burlington, by the way. I never really find anything with this Burlington. I mean, I found a couple things here and there, but never anything really to write home about. And then we've got Michaels over here. We'll drive forward and we'll turn around in Michaels. to the next spot. I don't see anybody. Let's check this super fast. Uh -oh. Doors open so we gotta some paper. It's a cool skeleton bird. Since we put back on, that's cool. Okay. Skeleton bird and some cricket paper. Okay. We'll take that. Let's head up to the next destination. See you guys there. All right, we're gonna check this Kirkland's real quick. Is there anything in here? No. 
nothing today. <clears throat> Should start getting more stuff though as the season comes because it's starting to get a little bit more into season so they're going to be starting to get a bunch of stuff. So there'll be more I'm assuming. All in due time, time. Looks like they're waiting for Barnes & Noble to open their door, so we're definitely going to check it. We're just going to go slow here. Maybe they give their stuff away or clearance it out to be sold completely first. I used to get boxes and boxes of toys and bags and bags of Funko Pops. I still have Funko Pops left over for that Funko Pop haul when I found like two or three garbage bags full of them. Where are those days at? are all empty. I don't know if there's going to be a spirit here or not this year. We can go check real quick. There's usually a spirit in this mall every year. But they might have built the store up to where there's not going to be one now. see it on the doors anymore. So probably not this year. Okay, well. The dumpster, what's in the dumpster? Nothing. A bunch of skip dumpsters today, but there's absolutely nothing in them. Okay, this area is done for. Let's go down to the next spot. garbage truck is getting the recycling trash right now and then we're going to go check PetSmart real quick and see if there's anything in there and then we're off to Higley to see if there's any more food in the Safeway dumpster and then that's it we got a little bit of a truck though today not bad for our first haul back out for a while as soon as he leaves we're going to back up a little bit Oh, I did not want to get up this morning. I know there's a spirit here somewhere. I don't know where it's at though. We're gonna stop right here. It's probably that right there. Let's see if there's anything in PetSmart. I 
Oh, look. Not wrong with that. Or this. Or this. Dog costume or something. Cookies, I'm not taking those. Oh well, we got these leash and collars, and this looks like a dog costume. I don't know. Huh? Right here. Alright, we're gonna go check Higley. See what's going on there. Alrighty guys, here we are with a little bit of load we found today. Not a bad uh, retail haul for the first day back in a while. Um, a lot of Halloween stuff today. So I got my packing supplies, which I always love to get. Um, two bags of dog food for my friend who is on, dis uh, not disability, but he's, he's on social security and doesn't get a lot of money and he has a dog. So I give him dog food. I got a roll of this mesh here. We got these here, which I think are Halloween hats for dogs and a cape we got a leash and a um, body harness matching a couple of shoes which I always put in the pile of shoes because I always have extras or not extras this is a chew toy and then we got um, the tarot readings from Michaels it's got a couple little broken areas that I can just touch up um, Wicked Witch and her Monsters sign. We got this cool looking little uh, bird. Um, we got the Zoo Med thing from PetSmart. Let's see if it works. We got this little necklace holder which I can use in my case at my store. Um, some stuff here for crafts. We got some craft masks here. We got this out of um, Burlington. So the earrings aren't going to be any good because they don't match, but nice little necklace and pendant. Um, spiders, skulls, we got a little squishy cat head, some witch's boots. We got an awesome pumpkin patch wheelbarrow with nothing wrong with it, with some um, moss. We got a boo sign. We got a curses, magic, and book of spells thing here. We got some, I think this is um like, what you call it, for the... Um, tops of your cabinets. We have this thing here which is um, it's got a cute little mushroom stuff in it. It looks like it's missing a couple of them but it's um, tabletop decor and it has witch's brew and stuff like that on it. We got these which I don't know what they are. They look like maybe they're pecans for just decoration. Um, we got some Halloween chains. We got this cute little house that needs the hinge put back on, just a little bit of glue and it'll look a little hobbit house box. We got a cutting ruler for Cricut, $29.99, bunch of Cricut uh, paper. We got some tags which I can use in my store, some frames, a tumbler, some paper, some flowers, um, and then over here we got three of the cat, little cat houses, and they're perfectly fine so what we're going to do with those we're just going to um, probably donate them I'm not sure yet um, but they're sleepy huts there's three of them and then we got four boxes of the twin pack clear care um, cleaning and disinfecting solution for lenses so somebody can use those so not a bad day for my first day back. Um, really feel bad for my tree aloe. It was really, really doing really, really good. And then the storm came along and knocked it over and back out of the pot again. So now it's got to reestablish itself. I'm not happy about that.
anyway i appreciate you guys coming along with me hope it was fun always fun for me um, i'm back to two videos a week at least um, so keep watching there'll be more videos coming and i'll see you as always at the dumpsters ciao for now